Okay. So, I am from a small town that's just a short drive away from Topeka, Kansas, which is where, you know, Fred Phelps and the Westboro Baptist Church and all that is located, and I go there all the time to see friends or to go to work, things of that nature, and I can't even count how many times I've seen Fred Phelps and his church picketing at funerals and at weddings. Um, or just on the street to attract attention, and like even as a child, I remember driving past them with my family, and you know I see my mother rolling down her window, and shouting, you know, shame on you, you're twisting God's word, shame on you, shame on you, and I have to say I don't hate anyone or anything in life at all, except to see people spreading hate. I don't hate people who hate, I don't, like I said, I don't hate anything or anyone, I just hate to see people spreading hate. And that's all that Fred Phelps and his church does. And you're right, what they do has nothing to do with religion. Um, it's just a scapegoat they use to just be assholes to homosexuals and people who support homosexuality. And I'm going to be completely honest, completely honest here. I'm, up until a couple months ago, I have been an in the closet bisexual for about eight years. And it was people like Fred Phelps and his church and his followers that made me terrified to be honest with myself and other people about my sexuality. But now it's just like, who gives a shit? You know, God made me the way that he made me for a reason. And if it's wrong, I'm guilty. Uh, if it's a crime, I stand convicted. But I, I don't care. It's who I am. This isn't who I choose to be. This is who I am, and this is how I feel. You can't help who you like or don't like. You can't help who you fall in love with, you know. I mean, if he wants to get on somebody's ass, what he should be doing is picketing his fucking self. His bitter, misguided, and hateful self. Because when it comes to this shit, there is no crime being committed on the homosexual community's part at all. The only crime underway is of Fred Phelps and his family and the people who follow him. And it truly, deeply hurts and disgusts me and makes me sad very, very sad for the world that we live in, that this even exists at all. And the saddest part about all of it is that all you can do for them is just pray and nothing else.